I came to visit Ron and Marianne on my way to Fairbanks because they live halfway in between and it's a warm cabin I can stay at. But it's about 100 miles more to Fairbanks. And I'm um, running my dogs there, 10 dogs, to uh, sell my fur. And my fur is what buys me my rest of my winter's trapping meat. So if you want to get Mommy a real nice present this year, maybe a fur stole or a fur hat would be real good. Because that's what supports people like me and people in villages all across Alaska. These are mink. mink the fur buyer buys mink inside out. See the little spots on there? Little spots on the inside of the fur? This is the leather side, of course. It's the inside. No spots means that's a good mink. There's spots on all my mink. Now, how much uh, do you get for a, for a mink fur? Mink might get you 30 bucks for a good one and a really nice martin. These are all martins. They call them fisher down in the south. I don't know why they call them something different down there, but they do. But a nice martin might get you 70 bucks. I only got a few. This one, these three are probably worth 70. Now this will buy your supplies. It's probably worth about 60 or 50. And this will help buy your supplies for you and your uh, wife and uh, and your son. Hopefully I've got a thousand bucks here, but probably not that. Much. And that constitutes uh, winners of trapping out here. Uh, so far the winter. This is uh, this is late December, so this is about half the year. Half that's the year pretty trapping. good. Yeah, that's okay. Okay. A lot of people do better than that, but. Okay, Bill. Well, you have a nice safe trip into Fairbanks, selling your fur there. This is Ranger Ron signing out, campers. This is Big Bill saying bye-bye. <laughs>